These are my three best tips for property investors. First of all, look at getting depreciation reports on your property if they're less than 25 years of age or have renovations done. Because I've seen many people miss out on thousands of dollars come tax time because they weren't aware of this. Speak to your accountant. Number two, if you are looking at buying a subdividable property, whether it be an R30, R40 lot, a lot of the time you're actually getting a home on the land. Now, this will normally return, say, $280, $300 a week. It goes a long way to actually servicing the loan while you're going through the application process. It does help. Number three, really, really important that you get the property priced right from day one in the current rental market. There's a bit of an oversupply, so you want to have a situation where you get to choose your tenant and you're avoiding long vacancy periods. These are my tips for property investors.